uh, a piece of advice or many, maybe many pieces of advice for young girls who are just on the threshold of their personal lives, professional lives, some pointers you think they should keep in mind, some something that you would like to share? Yeah, specifically for girls, uh, never give up on your financial independence. Never, ever. Hmm. Uh, even if it's little, even if it's something uh, that people tell you is not enough, earn whatever little you can. Educate yourself. Be financially independent. Um, hmm. That is one. Hmm. Uh, second, um, get married for the right reasons. Uh, mm. because uh, the, the, these are decisions which will affect the entire course of your life. True. So get married uh, when you're ready for it, emotionally, uh, mentally, financially, physically. Mm. Uh, it's your life. Don't rush into it just because people tell you or it's expected, uh, you know, have the courage to um, do it when you want to. Mm -hmm. And lastly, um, Learn to recognize um, stereotyping and misogyny. Hmm. Uh, I think that is very important because um, patriarchy is ingrained in us now. Yes. Patriarchy is almost a part of our genotype now. Hmm. So um, learn, you know, question yourself when you do something. Is this the real me? Hmm. Or is this me under the influence of the world? Uh, I, I'll give an example for that. So, and once you realize that you're doing something under pressure mm. or that something's not okay, call it out. If you're not comfortable with something, call it out. If you feel that you have been objectified, stereotyped, call it out. Because you're doing yourself a favor, you're doing all the other women a favor. Mm -hmm. But you're not going to be able to do that till you know what's happening. Yeah. See, you have to realize one thing that there is, like I said, now it's a part of our genotype. So there are so many what I call default settings in us, you know, mm -hmm. uh, like there's this little thing like I, if I chose to take my spouse's name after marriage, it was more like, a. I mean, it was like something I didn't think about. Right? Yeah, it was yeah, right, that right. everyone does it. But my daughter will not do it. I mean, she's like, she asked me, mom, how could you do this? And I'm like, no, I didn't mind doing it. No one forced me. Yeah. So yeah, get your default settings right. If you don't want to do it, don't do it. If you want to do it, it's okay. So I'll give you one example. So about a year ago, we were applying to a school. We wanted to change one of the kids' uh, schools. And uh, so they had this whole online application process. And we fill, I filled it up. I filled it up. I am mm -hmm. the more active parent when it comes to these things. So I filled up everything. And then I waited for them to call us. And nothing happened. And then I called them one day. And they said, we sent you a couple of mails and you didn't reply. So I asked my husband. So mm -hmm. he said, yeah, I don't know. Maybe they went to spam. I was traveling. And they had sent him the mails. So I just spoke to the school. I said, yeah, are you sending him the mails? He's traveling most of the time. Mm. So, you know, the lady just typed something on a computer and she's like, uh, ma'am, uh, you have given his, uh, it's his email ID, which is the, that's the primary parent. Okay. So the school actually had a form which said primary parent and other parent. And I actually filled up his name as primary parent. Yeah. I filled yeah. it. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that, I mean, even after being so aware and after talking to you so much, I actually did that. Hmm. So the thing hmm. is that we have to realize that we are also conditioned. Yes, yes, absolutely. You know, and not at every moment in our lives are we able to run away from that conditioning. So once you realize, you will automatically change. See, here the school was absolutely right. Yes. Normal school says father, mother. The school mm. gave me the choice. I still goofed up, right? So what I'm trying to say is that, you know, you need to understand uh, what exactly uh, patriarchy has done to our society. You know, there are so many things which we, we just take upon ourselves, uh, women. Mm. So take, a, take what you want upon yourself. Take the burdens that you can carry. Uh, you know question these things uh, and then uh, live your life and then you'll find gradually that your life is very different 
so that's what i want to you know actually tell uh, girls okay great very very actually insightful